What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to another video. In today's video, we're going to be talking about the top three shoes that everyone should have in the wardrobe. Now, before I get started into the video, I just want to say that this is my personal opinion. So if you have any other suggestions about shoes that you think everyone should have in the wardrobe, let me know down in the comments. Now, today's video is not going to be a shoe collection. If you guys would like to see that, please let me know down in the comments. But today, I'm just going to mainly focus on just the top three shoes that everyone should have that I think are essential for building a strong, solid wardrobe. But that's enough talking for today, let's get into shoe number one. Now for shoe number one, it's gonna be a pair of black boots. Now I think we can all agree that the boots are the most versatile silhouette. I think you can stand them up, down, it can be shorts, it can be pants, white leg pants, whatever you want. So I feel like boots are something that everyone should have in the wardrobe. For me, the Doug Martens Rick Owens collab is something that I always go to. They're easy to style, you can just throw them on, they kind of go with everything. But there's plenty of options out there. I know the YSL Luca boots, I've been trying to get my hands on one of those. I really like those, just plain black. You mainly want to focus on something that you're going to be wearing down the road. You see yourself wearing it like five years from now, I think I'm always going to be wearing these. You can also do like a regular pair of Doug Martens, you can do the YSL boots like I mentioned. You can do something more like budget friendly that you might like. It's really up to you, but I think boots is definitely a good option for shoe number one. Now, as much as we've been drifting away from sneakers, I think we should all have that pair of sneakers that you can drift up, down, that can provide you versatility, that can provide you comfort for you every day, or like if you have an event that you can kind of throw them on with a suit, pair of dress pants, whatever you need to do with the sneakers and you need to be comfortable, you're going to be walking a lot, you definitely need a pair of sneakers. For me, these, the Fugazi, Fugazi, one in the chamber, are the pair that I usually gravitate towards to the most. I really, really, really love the shoes. I love what Trevor did with them. And it's a pair that I find myself going back to them a lot. I've been wearing them a lot lately. You can kind of see they're kind of dirty already. And one of the bullets fell off, but I really, really love this shoe. For you, it might be a different pair. Maybe the AOD 550s, New Balances, or maybe like a more budget-friendly Reebok Club 85, I believe they are, something like that. Or like Jordan 1s, Adidas, Jordan 4s, whatever it is that you really like and you enjoy wearing, and they're very comfortable for you, you definitely should have a pair of sneakers in your rotation. Now you have a pair of boots that you can dress up and down and you got a pair of sneakers that you can dress up and down providing you comfort just in case you need to walk a lot and that brings us to shoe number three and shoe number three for me is going to be a statement piece these are my statement piece Rick Owens kiss boots I've been wearing them a lot I love these I already learned how to walk in them you can kind of see I have them all like dragged and scuffed but I really love the shoe and my advice to you is just if you like the shoes wear them because they're just going to be sitting there and you paid a lot of money just to not wear the shoes i've been trying to get my hands on the other pair with the grills in the front but they're very expensive and i'm just waiting for them to go on sale because i'm not trying to spend two thousand dollars in a pair of boots now there's tons of statement pieces out there for you it might be a different boot tabby boots for example i really love tabby boots i'm trying to get my hands on a pair of them as well so if you have a pair i'm a 42 or a 9 let me know down in the comments i'm trying to get a steal on one of those but there's tons of options out there. There's these, there's the Rick Owens Lego glitter sole boots. I love those. The Dirk Beckenbergs, I don't know if I said that right. Let me know down in the comments. Any shoe that you really like. You can also have a pair of sneakers that is a statement piece. A statement piece in general that you really like and you enjoy having them in your closet. A neck breaker. A pair of shoes that your grandma probably hates. My grandma hates these. She doesn't like them, but I love them. And that is it for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Now, before you go, I want to say a huge thank you, a huge shout out to you guys. You guys have been amazing to me, commenting in the video, subscribing, and I really appreciate that. Please consider subscribing if you haven't already. Leave me a like if you really enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys in the next video.